In this week's video, I want to talk about understanding the value of your coaching program. And this is really important when it comes to picking your price point and feeling good about what you have to offer and being able to communicate to other people what it is you do and the value of it and the price. Like I said, you want to feel aligned with this and good about it so that when you are selling your program and telling people about how you can help them, that you feel really confident around this piece. So the first thing that you want to know when it comes to communicating the value is your niche. And I have a video where I walk you more specifically into picking your niche. Um, I'll link that video below this video if you want to check that out. Um, but that's the first important piece because when you know your niche, then you know really like who is the person that you're working with and what's the big problem that they have. And that's really the starting point um, so that we can, we can know that piece. We can know, okay, what, what's the big problem that this person has? Who is this person? And how is it showing up for them in their life? And that's really the second piece is, is understanding the impacts that this problem has on this specific person's life. And so let's just go with the example of weight loss. Um, and let's say that your, your target market um, is a woman, let's say, and she's 30, right? So you want to understand how this problem is showing up in this woman's life and the impacts that's having on her life. So let's say that it's keeping her from dating because she doesn't feel confident in her body. It's keeping her from maybe going on vacation because she doesn't want to put on a swimsuit and she feels embarrassed by that. Um, maybe keeping her from wearing the clothes that she really wants to be wearing because she doesn't feel um, confident in the clothes or she feels like she looks fat or they're too tight. Um, and just spending each day maybe looking in the mirror and picking herself apart and not feeling good about herself, right? Like we, we understand how this problem is showing up in this person's life and the impacts that it's having on a day-to-day -day basis and really the experiences that they may be missing out on in their life because of this. Maybe she's missing out on those vacations. Maybe she's missing out on the partner that she really wants to have, or even going out with her friends because all the outfits that she puts on, she's like, oh my gosh, I don't look good and I feel fat and um, you know, I, I don't even wanna go out now, right? So you can, you can understand the impacts it's having and the, the things that she is missing out on in her life. And then the other thing you wanna dive into is if she doesn't make any changes and she stays where she is right now, what, what will her life look like in the next five to 10 years, right? And what are the things that she may continue to miss out on or that she'll miss out on? What are the potential like health impacts that this could have on her life as well? And really knowing like the costs, like the physical, mental, emotional, um, and the cost, even the financial costs of not solving this issue. Maybe she's going on tons of different diets or trying tons of different supplements, um, paying for gym, gym memberships that she's not using, right? Like there's actually a uh, financial cost too, to not solving this problem. And so you want to understand that, like, what is the cost for your ideal client to not solve this problem? What's the cost? What are they going to miss out on in their life? What are the financial costs? What are the emotional costs of not feeling good, not feeling confident for that person? Okay. And then knowing like, okay, if they did make these changes, if they were able to solve this problem, where would they be? And what would their life look like? and seeing what is actually possible for that person and knowing how much better life is when they have made that change, when they are in that place. And for a lot of us, we can relate to that ourselves because we're helping people with something that we have struggled with. And when I look back at my life at certain things that I've struggled with, um, you know, definitely struggling with, I've struggled with like emotional eating and body image stuff. And when I look at where I was in my life and what my experience was in my life, truly day to day, every single day, um, overall versus, you know, now what I'm not struggling with that, like what my life looks like and how much better it is, how much better that experience is. I mean, it's truly priceless. I, I mean, I can't even put a price on it. Um, and that's something that I would have paid, you know, anything to have someone help me with. 
Um, and I did, I did invest in coaching to have someone help me with that. And so you want to really understand that, like the value of solving that problem for someone. And when you think about the value of your specific coaching offer, you want to think about, okay, so this person who's been struggling with this often is something they've been struggling with for years, right? They haven't been able to find a solution to it and they're feeling stuck. And for us, what we're offering with our coaching program is a solution, the missing piece that often people aren't getting that's going to help them get the result they want. So for example, when it comes to weight loss, a lot of people are going on all these different diets. Um, you know, they're uh, trying maybe weight loss supplements and going to gyms and doing crazy workouts and all this stuff. They're still not seeing the results they want and why. And for a lot of us as coaches, like that's what we understand as having gotten the results. And for, you know, a lot of times for people, it's not having the accountability, not having the support, not having the mindset shifts or the habit shifts that need to go behind these things to make this change. And that's what we're offering in our coaching program so that people can actually get the result that they want, even though they haven't been able to get it for years. And so you want to understand that yourself as far as your program and your offering and how it is uh, really helping people bridge the gap of where they are now and where they want to be and why they aren't getting that result. Like, what is it that you're going to help them do that's going to help them bridge that gap? And once they bridge it and they get that result and they get to where they want to go, what are the costs that they're going to be avoiding? Like I said, maybe they're investing in diets, going to, you know, paying for gym memberships, like all this stuff that they're not even using and it's not helping them get the results and really recognizing how much better their life and their experience will be once they get that result. Okay. So this is how you really understand the value of what you have to offer. And you see, like I could help someone change their life. Um, you know, their day-to-day -day experience each and every day, I could help them avoid all these, all this pain, all this mental, emotional pain and, um, avoid these experiences that they're having, or they could have in the future. Maybe it's health problems. And so that's really the value of what you have to offer. And that is why what you have to offer is super valuable. And yes, you can be charging the price point that you want to be charging that feels aligned for you and for your client, because you are helping people create such an amazing, uh, life-changing transformation in their, in their life. Okay. And so I want you to keep that in mind when you are thinking about the value of what you have to offer and also when you're communicating it to other people and really understanding this and, and communicating, okay, these are all the pain points you could be missing out on or you could be not having to experience when you solve this problem, right? And this is what's possible for you and really painting that picture. But that's really the value of your coaching program, of what you have to offer as a coach. Um, and when you understand that, you can feel so much com more confident in helping people and in charging the prices you want to be charging. So I'd love to hear your biggest takeaway from this video. Let me know in the comments below and get out there, start sharing your amazing program with people because it is valuable and it can change people's lives. And if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. If you want more videos just like this, and thank you so much for joining me and I will see you in next week's video.